Hello everybody, it's Christian Wilson here with the new plan, brand new PlayStation Vita review. This console, this little portable system is a great system. The resolution is absolutely gorgeous on a PSP compared to a Nintendo device. Yet it has no 3D next to its predecessor, uh, the, not its predecessor, but its competitor, the 3DS. It has a great screen, it plays videos very nice, but the audio is a little low. Um, this is the trophies that come with the new PlayStation 3, the new PSP. Yeah, and the new app. It's an application that comes with the PS Vita. You can look at your PlayStation Vita trophies or your PlayStation 3 trophies, like for instance the Battlefield 3 trophies that I've recently got, like one of the trophies called "This Is the End." Fail to prevent attack. Well, that's just in there. But yeah, trophies are great. Uh, this is the music application. That's Sonic, by the way. Don't, don't ask why I like the music. But the audio on it without the audio input put in is very nice. But here's another app that allows you to uh, chat with your friends from PlayStation itself. Say they got a mic or a chat like with messaging. But yeah, that's the party application. See, I don't have a party started, so I can't really explain that to you. I'm very sorry. Uh, next is the group messaging, which allows you to text people as a texting feature, like the iPhone itself. Like, I'll show you an example with one of my friends. Excuse the language. Uh, we were just having a little bit of fun talking about some, talking about something. But yeah, if you're wondering about the internet browser, the internet browser runs really smoothly. Um, actually not really smoothly, but runs pretty fast. I mean, compared to what I'm looking at with the, uh, let's run it, PlayStation3.com. As you can see, it's, uh, it's starting to load up. And bam, already up. It runs very fast compared to what I think it would. Um, I don't recommend using the Facebook app. I, re app. I recommend you go to the Internet Explorer itself, because I found it faster on the Internet Explorer than it was this. And if you're wondering about this new application called Near and how it compares to the 3DS, I honestly think that the Near is a little more... I don't know. But the 3DS offers you stuff when you walk around. This doesn't, but it calculates your date, uh, how much, which you've been walking, exactly how much you've been walking. Uh, I don't think it counts your steps, but it locates people that are nearby, like the Spot Pass with the 3DS. I like it, I'll show all my stuff. And I ran into 18 people with a PlayStation Vita, which is kind of surprising since I got this at launch. But yeah, it shows how people I ran into. Discoveries. And. Where's that one? One. And apparently four games. They'll pop up in a minute. And there it is. 18 people playing nearby, which is, go check that out later, it's pretty interesting, I found 18 people about But basically, yeah, that's the near app. Let's uh, let's go close some applications because I've had them up. Uh, you have to close applications and restart and start them up with some games if you're not using them. But let's use the camera app. That it comes with. Um, I thought you were gonna get a really bad camera on this, honestly, but the frames on it are pretty, pretty bigger than I thought it would be. It's a decent camera too. Um, takes video. I will be having a demonstration with the camera and the video compared with the PS Vita and the vi and the uh, Nintendo 3DS itself. But yeah, that's basically it. If uh, if you saw in the beginning of the video with me change with me having that background. You can change your background by clicking the uh, typing the three dots on the side. And it says use as start screen. You click that and save it as that. Right, but if I so that's the PlayStation Vita for you. I'll be doing reviews for games later on, as uh, for more more Storm Apop Apocalypse RC, which I actually you can get for free for a limited time on the PlayStation Store right now. But I'd overall have to give this console a nine. Uh, thank you for watching, Legit Gamer. This is Christian Olsen signing out.